McDonald's. Have you ever wondered how the name McDonald's started? The name McDonald's simply came from the surname of the two brothers who created the famous restaurant. The two brothers' name are Maurice and Richard McDonald's. And just like any other businesses, the two brothers encountered many challenges before achieving success by earning millions of dollars of sales. But how did it all start? What are McDonald's secret business strategies from then and now that you might not know yet? So let us go back to different years of how it all started. Who knows, you might get an idea on how powerful their business strategies were and see if we can get something valuable. In 1940, the brothers McDonald's started their restaurant in San Bernardino, California. It is initially named Air Drone, where hot dogs is the first item sold. Hmm, I don't think it sounded interesting and catchy at all, you know, to call a place to eat. Well, anyway, the hamburgers were later added to the menu at a cost of 10 cents with all you can drink orange juice at 5 cents. Eventually, the brothers named, named McDonald's Barbecue and had 25 menu items. Well, mostly barbecue, of course. They used a car hop business style. It was common at that time. And they employed around 20 car hops. The waitress delivers the order to the buyers as they park their car around the restaurant and it became a popular and highly profitable teen hangout. In 1948, eight years later, after noticing that almost all of their profits came from hamburgers, the brothers closed the restaurant for several months to remodel. And on December 12, 1948, the car hops were eliminated, making the new restaurant a self-service operation, implementing their innovative speedy service system, a streamlined assembly line for hamburgers. They installed a self-service counter where they prepared their burgers ahead of time and kept the food warm on their high-powered heat lamps. And by doing so, they didn't need to rely on waiters or waitresses and they were able to sell their food for half the price. This business design gave them an overwhelming edge against their competitors at that time. At 15 cents, the burgers are about half as expensive as at standard diners and they are served immediately. The restaurant is extremely successful and its fame spreads by word of mouth. And the restaurant's name was changed again, and this time to simply McDonald's. In 1952, the brothers hired architect Stanley Clark Meston to design a replacement for the San Bernardino stand, which is to have even greater efficiency and a more eye-catching appearance. Meston and his assistant, Charles Fish, delivered the Golden Arcs design. Further marketing techniques were implemented to change McDonald's from a sit-down restaurant to a fast food chain and then the McDonald's brothers opened the business for franchise. In 1953, the brothers began seeking franchises. The first franchisee was Neil Fox, a distributor for General Petroleum Corporation. 
Their second franchisee was the team of Fox's brother-in-law, Roger Williams and Burdett Bud Landon, both of whom also worked for General Petroleum. And they opened their stand in Downey, California. The Downey stand has the distinction of being the oldest surviving McDonald's restaurant. In 1954, entrepreneur and milkshake mixer salesman Ray Kroc becomes fascinated by the McDonald's restaurant during a sales visit when he learns of its extraordinary capacity and popularity. After seeing the restaurant in operation, Kroc approaches the McDonald's brothers who have already begun franchising with a proposition of to let him franchise McDonald's restaurants outside the company's home base of California and Arizona. 1955, Crocs' first McDonald's restaurant opened on April 15, 1955 in Des Plaines, Illinois, near Chicago. Ray Kroc founds McDonald's Systems Incorporated as a legal structure for his planned franchises. In 1960, Ray renamed his company McDonald's Corporation. And in 1961, Crocs' conflict over the vision of the company where the founding brothers had grown to an unbearable extent, and he asked them how much money they wanted to leave their business to him entirely. The brothers asked for $2.7 million, and that's about $21.6 million in today's dollars. And the rest is history. McDonald's. Care for a little tour? We wanted something different, and that's when my brother here comes up with one of his brilliant ideas. Orders ready in 30 seconds, not 30 minutes. A ding ding like glittering. <laughs>